All right, everybody, we are back. It's been uh, a couple weeks. I apologize. I had uh, super busy events. Um, I drive truck for a living, so if I come home for the weekend, I can get a project done. But uh, I was not able to come home for the weekend. On the one weekend or the other weekend, I just didn't have enough time to do it. And I was waiting on my four-jaw chuck that I had to order because I had my other one seemed to be stripping out where it just doesn't want to properly hold. I got some walnut here. It's a Y piece, crotch piece. Uh, I got some cracks on this end. I did trim some cracks off on this end and a little bit off on that end. Uh, but I think I might be able to just cut these out. All right, I'm going to sand this up from 60 through probably 320. I'm not going to show it because it's going to take me a while and it's just kind of boring. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to leave it just like this and get it sanded. 
Got some real nice shimmers going on right in here. I'll bring it back when I'm done sanding. All right, we got it sanded it down all the way to 320. I'm pretty happy with uh, how it feels. I also took my uh, sandal flex and sanded the top side. I'm going to be coating this with shellac. No particular reason except for I know it uh, looks nice. All right, I'm gonna give about two more coats and then I'm going to bring it back when I flip this around. It's looking pretty darn good. See you in a bit. All right, we got this thing flipped around and mounted and uh, ready to start turning. I got it put on my new jaws that I got. Uh, I'm not paid to say this, but the one I got is the uh, G3 Protec. Nova. We'll see how it works. this is I've never had it with walnut it's a little yellowish greenish color down in there it's very hard to cut too almost like to keep that in the bowl but I got to go deeper
All right, that's all the footer I'm gonna go with this. I'm gonna go ahead and sand it down, same as the outside, 60 through 320. And I'll bring it back when we go to put some finish on it. All right, this is gonna be the same as the outside. Just a couple coats of shellac, and then uh, we're gonna turn this thing around, take the bottom off. I'm gonna sand this little nub off. Well, more than this little nub. And uh, I'll bring it back when I'm done and got this bottom finished. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We have a uh, walnut bowl made out of a crotch piece. Isn't that just amazing? Get the, clearly, you can tell it's a crotch piece. Uh, that greenish yellow that I was seeing disappeared. It was kind of like right in the center here. Very hard to cut. I don't know what it was. It would, I've never seen that color in walnut before. Um, but, hey, we still got some good character, though. So we got the outside here. Look at that. Absolutely amazing. Got some nice spalting going on right there between the two. Bottom is nice and done. Got a nice color on the bottom. Um, the edge, uh, the natural edge turned out pretty nice. Got some, some detail on the top. Uh, a little bit left bark and stuff that, well, I, the bottom part of the bark that stuck on there. I tried picking it off. didn't want to come off very easy, so I just left it on there. More detail. Uh, let me see what it looks like from here. And we got... I like, I just kind of like how it, it looks like the bottom is like it is, well the bottom is a white and it looks like this black just kind of wraps for the bowl, um, like a horseshoe. It looks kind of cool. Don't you think? I like it. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I appreciate y'all hanging out. I uh, had a hard time getting some videos put up lately. And uh, I hope it was worth the wait. I'm glad you guys stuck around to watch this. Forgot to mention, I got, you see right there, I don't know what they call that, but uh, 
kind of looks like the, you know, curly maple looks. It's kind of got the same detail right there. You can see all my, see all my lights <laughs> and the shininess. Anyway, that's going to be it for me. Um, I want to say thanks to my friend Tate for giving me this wood. It uh, came out real nice. I picked it up last year. And, um, yeah, we're going to turn some more of these. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, do all that fun stuff. Uh, appreciate y'all hanging out. And uh, I do have a uh, YouTube and a Rumble account. They're both uh, Patriot Wood Turning. And I try to put one up at least once a week. 4 p.m. on YouTube, 3 p.m. on Rumble. Like I always tell you, don't burn it. Turn it. And have fun doing it.